dazu. <lacht> So guys, today I am going to make a new video on how I specifically dry my hair after every bathing and um, what I do and uh, how I comb my hairs after that. Like many of you were asking me to make a video on this, so I just thought that why not? I should or I am with this video, so make sure you watch this video till the end. Hey guys right now my hairs are wet as you guys can see kindly ignore those uh, bags over there uh, they are my thrown away clothes so kindly do not mind them okay so first what we're gonna do is we're gonna apply this live on serum to our hair you can apply whichever serum you feel is comfortable but i have been applying live on serum since many years so yes this is comfortable for me okay and we're gonna do this on our wet hair itself okay just apply it to the end like the lengths of our hair not on the roots okay never apply any serum on the roots okay and you can see how nice my hairs are looking right now we have to make them look even more nice <laughs> all right so after we have applied the serum we'll do one thing we'll solve the tangles out of our hair yeah i would like to give you one tip that is before going for bathing you should always remember that you always wash uh, you always wash your hairs only after the tangles are solved okay never ever bathe before your tangles are unsolved or you have tangles in your hair okay never do that so it becomes easier for you to solve the tangles after bathing right so always remember that tip of mine and the right way to comb your hair is of course from the roots till the bottom of your hair length but always remember that if you have a tangle right now i don't have any tangles in my hairs but if you have a tangle like suppose if i have tangle right here in this portion then what am i going to do i'm going to hold my hairs like this so that the pressure the uh, pressure of how i'm pulling my hairs doesn't cause any you know uh, wrong effects or side effects to my roots so to take care of my roots i will be holding my hairs like this and then i'll be solving the tangle okay so that my roots don't get pulled i have to turn off the fan i have to turn off the ac because both of them make a lot and a lot and a lot of noise so they don't let me speak so as i want my audio to be more clear and uh, you know you guys could hear me so i have to turn this off and i have to sweat so kindly bear with it okay and here you can see we are probably done with solving all the tangles once okay now we're gonna take the help of the dryer one more thing i would like to clear over here that whoever says this that a uh, dryer is not good for your hairs it damages your scalp that damages your hairs and all that stuff i personally don't believe this i believe that uh i guess dryer helps you uh get rid of the wetness which you cause after uh, either getting uh, sweaty or either getting um your bath so it's always good that if you blow dry your hairs every day that's my belief now it's my duty to clear all the myths which i feel that at least smart people should know that no that was a myth okay so we'll move fast to the dryer now <laughs> One more thing that I would like to tell you guys that uh, whenever you're blow drying your hair, always remember that you don't specifically blow dry your hair on a specific part of your scalp that might, you know, you might uh, get burned or you might, you know, get chatka sort of thing. So it's better <laughs> that you um, keep moving the dryer so that, you know, it doesn't uh, heats up your specific part of your scalp. Okay, always remember that. After blow drying our hair a little bit, we'll comb our hairs once again. And that's how I do every time. You can feel my few portions of my hairs are still 
wet and for that what we're gonna do is we are gonna make uh, two partitions like this okay we are gonna comb the hair once again like this now what you need is a clip so that you can just tie your hairs okay to do is make two portions over here again like this tie up your hairs like this okay take the dryer again okay take the dryer again and blow dry these specific hairs of yours okay nicely my hairs are looking right now show you nice right so all these uh, tangles are solved and it's all completely dry now we'll open this portion of our hair after blow drying it again comb your hairs nicely we'll move forward to the another side you can clearly see the difference of how these hairs are looking solved and how these hairs are looking <laughs> you can see so now we'll move forward to the next part this part your hairs again into two portions okay keep these hairs behind two portions like this As you can see, we have probably solved the tangles. Uh, now we'll open up these hairs. <laughs> After this, we are probably done with drying our hairs. And I'm super tired. Yes. You can see how nice my hairs are looking then you can do the specific hairstyle whichever you feel is correct for your hair you yeah i'll show it to you wait so guys you you can see how my hair is exactly looking uh, and i hope they are probably visible to you and i hope that they are looking nice so this is how it is looking So do comment down below uh, did you find this video helpful or no and uh, how did this video help you and uh, even uh, comment down below uh, your thoughts and what you want to watch next i would try shooting a video on that particular topic i'll surely do it <laughs> and yes do not uh, comment about the uh, eyeshadow stuff i know i have to create a video on that i'll inshallah super soon i would do that I will and like share share it with your friends ask them uh, to subscribe to and even this video would help them to you know comb their hair with this I like to take a leave from you guys thank you so much for watching this video I will see you very soon in my next video until then you guys take care love love bye Allah Hafiz Dua Mayad Rakhiega bye